Okay, so I think I want to keep Bloodhoof Brave because I do want to run that out on turn four against a priest. I think that's when it will be strongest. Well, we can also run it out on turn three. Twilight, I'm a dragon. That's an interesting question. Hope he doesn't play the 2-4. How many editors, oh, mods, and what have you are part of Day 9 TV? It's a large amount of mods. Um, plan these few turns for a moment. Um, I don't know. In terms of editors, 2-2. Two, two. Okay, it looks a little weird, but where there's a mill, there's a way. Is it a Megalodon? have to be very, 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 very careful about running out a cold light early against this particular deck. Doo -doo 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 -doo. What are the editor's names? What are their favorite animals? Due to my understanding of the internet, I will be relatively conservative, sharing their first names <laughs> and last names. Uh, T and S. Hello. Good to see you. How's it going? <laughs> He's so coy, that one, that day nine. Oh! I'm running out skill bonus. Trumpet's pretty much here always. Ghost Stalker. Wait, is Ghost Stalker modded? There is a probability that Ghost Stalker is actually not modded here. It's not here right now. Alright. So we have to do some slaying. I'm not that worried about being a 10 because it's a dragon priest, so it doesn't really have that many bursts. Um, Domo Arigato. What are you going to do, Legato? My, Jesus, my health's getting a little low. Ugh. Yeah, all right. Nice. I think I didn't play this out well. I think I should have just, like, coined out and killed that whelp right away and just begun beating his, his head in. Beating his head in and down. Beating his head in and down. Let's see what he does. Shadow Word, Pain. These decks tend to run like a Shadow Word Pain. Chill Maw out. My work is paramount. Leave me alone. Okay, so that means he has a dragon in hand, so that's cool, so we can 
can do this, which will give a spell power increase, which is going to be 7 damage. We're going to gain another dude. Oh! Oh my god! Ah, sick! Oh my god, sick! Skylar Ocean, 21 months. Oh! I wield the power. I dare you to heal yourself! Ah! Oh no, that's really, really, really bad. Ah, oh, that's especially really bad. Alright, we have to hope for no Cabal Shadow Priest one time. One time. One time, dude. I actually think I have to Cold Light. One time. He's holding a dragon! I think I gotta do it. Alright, that's it. That's that's the most I can do. Wait, what do you mean well played? Not all are lost. What is that doing in your deck? Mind Blast? Why? What? What's this Dragon Prophet Valen deck? What? I can't imagine that being a consistent deck. <laughs> this is the thing that I'm actually unsure what to do with. I really don't know what to do with this, because like... I have had... Okay, so granted in the last mm, three, four, five, six weeks, something like that in Hearthstone, Oh, keep him just a car. It's Paladin. I think I'll hold on to this because there's some aggro you guys. Uh no, I think I toss back revenge too, but I definitely keep it just a car. Um, okay, so so like for the last six weeks or so, I have been trying a lot of experimental stuff, right? This deck, for instance, is experimental, for sure. <laughs> like, that's that's what I like to do, but for duty. it feels like I have a high incidence of. Oh, I guess I I uh oh, I guess I lost to that now, and then I never see it again, and that's been happening. Oh, we are up against this thing. Okay, huh? I think we crush this. Um, what am I talking about? Yeah, I've just had a, a relatively high incidence of, like, losses where I just, I don't even know what I'm supposed to think afterwards. I'm just like, oh, well, I guess I... I guess, huh. And I feel like maybe what I should do is just pick some really consistent ultra aggro deck. And just bang my way up the ladder with it. But it even feels like when I do some of those ultra aggro consistent decks that are, you know, more straightforward to use. Welcome to the Grand Tournament, Champion. I still wind up losing. To a lot of like, the what, uh, 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 okay. Kind of things. There's a lot more Nizoth decks. There's a lot more. There's a shitload of Prince Malkazar decks. I don't know if anyone's seen this. 
Dude, there are so many Prince Malakazar decks on the ladder right now. It's insane arena. Oh my god, the person that we're up against, his name is Teets. So this is the Anything Can Happen Paladin, so he's gonna try to win condition us to death with two Anythings Can Happen. But if we can stay above 50 health, I think we're gonna win. Which is just an insane sentence, but you know, there it is. Mr. Klong just subscribed. What a name, Mr. Klong! <laughs> oh my god! And Mr. Klong was his name. -o. So Tetsu's Starcraft co-op is so much fun. I just started playing today, holy crap. Holy shit, it is so fun. Oh my god, it is so fun. So I can actually use the revenge right now, and that's gonna be just fine. Like, I don't know if any of you have played or not played StarCraft 2 co-op. It's just... Phenifia says, well, why weren't playing Just Garbage, didn't draw it last game? Yeah, I haven't drawn it uh, early on very often. That's great, yeah, it's fantastic. I don't want to gore howl because it's reasonable for him to have a Harrison in his deck. Put your faith in the light. That is a really early of that. And gaining all the armor that we can. StarCraft 2 co-op is insanely fun. So the way StarCraft 2 co-op works is that you play basically a 2v2 against some scenario where it's like, there's three bases and they're going to start sending attacks from you all over the place and you have to destroy each base in less than five minutes. So it's a 15 minute mission and you get to choose a commander and your commander is, um, you get like, I think it's about seven-ish units plus some abilities. Um... That's crazy. I have- I cannot for the life of me. I have no idea how many units you get. It feels like six, seven, or eight, something like that. Um... That's a pretty neat one. Doesn't matter. You get some weird, funky set of units, based upon whatever commander you chose, plus some abilities, and you use that combination of things to try to defeat this little scenario. So, I like Karax. Right? He's my robo-bro. Yes! Oh! Yes! Toasted! And Bingo was his name Oh, I should actually be brawling a little more aggressively because this deck doesn't really have that much scary stuff. Alarak just came out. And no one could get a game because everyone was queuing up as Alarak. <laughs> and then the commander you choose levels up and you can get more options and, and powers for your co-op thing. So, like, you know, if you're playing on the hardest difficulty, you really can't win at level one. You've got to grind up some uh, XP on it. Reporting for duty. Is it even possible to win anymore for him? I'm not sure. By the way, I don't know if you hear that noise, that... It's because i got the heater on. Boom! Mech Terran for life. Dude, I just love Karak so much. Hoot hoot! We also gotta save the brawls for the any fins can happen as well. It's gonna have to start spending some things. Brazen hippo. <laughs> Just. Oh, Despy's been a little sick lately. I've been really worried about her. Not really sick, she's just going, Choo! Choo! Uh, when she was a baby, she was very first days. She was a little sick. She was a little sneezy. She slept a lot. She's full of energy and has boundless desire to play. Um, Walto. I think this is a safe time to play it. She's a little sneezy. Hope she's okay. 
I'm monitoring the cat aggressively. Sheriff is just a little rotund pile of fur. See this little sneeze? Did you hear the sneeze? Oh, my baby cat. Yeah, so... The heat's turned up a little higher. The menagerie is for guests only. Oh, this monster, huh? Where there's a mill, there's a way. Can you chuck one? Is he just gonna heal for heal for two? Heal for two? How old's Despy now? Despy and Sheriff are two. Heal for two. Oh. Oh, you hear the sneezy baby? Oh. Casual 60 health. <laughs> Kev Gooey says, Hey, Day 9, how do you have, like, literally no background noise from your mic? I totally get background noise. <laughs> but I'm also sort of enclosed. I, my desk is at an L, and I have a green screen behind, so that sort of contains the sound a lot better. Can always just not kill this thing as well. Reporting for duty. I have no time for games. My turns are fairly straightforward. Hit a thing, armor up a thing, play a thing. Done. If I get my cold lights, I can demolish this guy. I think I would be willing to play up to one cold light. Weird, he just wanted to help clear his board a little bit. That's good. Probably zero cold lights. I mean, the thing that's, a, like, risky for him is that there is a high probability I can just burn his deck. Like, burn his wind conditions. If he loses the anything can happen, he's just, he's just dead. He's dead. He's dead. His life's bad. He's sad. He's cry from dad. What? This is the slowest deck he's ever played. Queen of Manor seems fast by comparison. Oh, yeah. No. No. Ah. What a monster. Reporting for duty. Do want to draw? We have none of our combo pieces. There's the whole combos in there. Well, there's the execute target. Yeah, this is the control. The control. Uh, what a paladin. Do you want to live in secto, baby? I anticipate we'll always be able to take care of this no problem. So let me... Let's see if he just hero powers and passes, because then I'll cold light him. Casually picks light permanent prompts up for day nine. Yes! Yeah! Did I try Tavern Brawl? I never really wind up trying it out. I think now is actually an okay time to do this. Especially when you run like that. Now if this kills anything can happen, we just win. I'm almost out of cards. That's amazing. That is amazing. Can we just, can we just note that? Wow. 
gonna go ahead and maybe mill the other one. No, the combo piece though. Oh. Calculated. Calculated. Sick. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Welcome to Day 9 TV. Where we're at 18 1 star, and I managed to make it feel impressive. That's amazing. Isn't that a little ironic that I burned anything can happen? You know yeah. what I mean? Versus Gul'dan. Your soul shall be mine. Victory. <laughs> <laughs> Holy fucking moly, man. Curious to know webcam and mic model. The webcam is a Microsoft Life Cam. The microphone is a blue snowball. The will to mill. I've never even thought of that, Thomas McGee. That's good. The will to mill. The will to. I, I hope there's someone who has a Twitch Prime uh, account. Very first time on Twitch, maybe a newcomer, enjoys dabbling in games, but is kind of do the whole Twitch thing, stepping in and realize they get a chance to subscribe to any community they want. Maybe should begin, you know, fishing around, see, oh, Hearthstone, I played that game, who's this guy, Day9, one of the top streamers, let's tune in, and the very first thing that person sees is me going, <laughs> and then they subscribe. That's, that's what I hope happens. I hope it goes in that order. I gotta keep this for the... For the invariable flurry of tentacles. Brezzy says, I was a bit before. Ah. Oh, crazy Chris, y'all sweet. Mo Pizzle says, I like to imagine Daynight's microphone is a literal blue snowball. <laughs> that would be. That would be hashbang tight. This is a sick, like, having these three the Ravaging Ghoul. The Revenge and the Brawl. Where is. There's my pen. Isn't all said subbing to you because you reminded me of the free sub. You are not the boss of me! Oh no, it's a Discardy guy. Don't you even. I think I do this. I gotta kill this and I gotta do that. <laughs> Phonethia. PFFTH is the ASCII representation of. <laughs> Day 9 goes. And four new subs appear. Maybe there's someone who's teetering on the edge and I'm. And they were like. That's amazing. Karakazam. I shouldn't have even hit that. I don't even know why. I should have just waited and ran out the ravaging wool. Maybe that's maybe that's how we lose. Maybe that's the end of the game. Maybe that's it. That's this GG. Only works on a oh my God, <laughs> he's learned our secrets. He's he's been doing some sick spy work. I, have I love doing that. It feels so good. Hit me less hard. 
Ah. I think I'm gonna pass a turn. I'm gonna do this combo. Do you have a favorite triple or quadruple? I just like quads. I just really, really, really like quads. I've been drinking a lot less, and I'm sort of going to be on a, a no beer bender for a while while I do my exercising and health eating. Get it out! Get it out! That's the one I can kill as long as he kills this. Oh, shoot. Shit, crap, cruddy, crap. If he hits this, that's pretty good. What type of exercising are you doing? Just, like, lift weights for a little bit, run for a little bit. Run a little bit. Hey, baby. When you come home. Yeah. bad. I think we, I mean, I, I just can't kill that. That's a... I could slam this twice, but I just don't want to do that, you know? I'm gonna go for my face, right? I need to... This is just terrible. I panicked, I don't know what to do. I'm doing like really basic. This thing, and like lying down with the free weight thing, and doing this free weight thing, the little shouldery things, you know. It's pretty blase. I just... Jesus. I mean, if I can get a Gorehow, we might even be able to stabilize. This only works on the simple-minded. Could have bashed Doomguard, armored up, and slammed it. Yeah, jeez, I don't know why. Pay attention, class. This only works on the simple-minded. We have two Violet Illusionists out. I should not attack with my minion. I didn't attack with this one now. Just biding my time. Oh. Commit Sudoku. Oh. Ah. Oh. Ugh. Okay, we're at eight. These two guys are gonna die, so I'm gonna do this. This. I'm ready to learn. Whew! We may stabilize yet. Blue Snowball better than the Yeti? Never used a Yeti. She uses a snoop, just use a blue snowball. The truth is in here. Ooh, that's dirty. Although, I think we're actually just shooting for fatigue at this point. Get 
Did that in the wrong order because I was just so mind blown. Uh he's got another Doom Guard in there too. Uh <laughs> That's nice. The truth is in here. Kara Kazam. Instruction begins. Welcome to the Grand I'm out of cards. He actually discarded the other Doom Guard. Damn. Kara Kazam, my friend. Why did he discard the power of overwhelming? Couldn't cast it. Oh my god. That was thick. So thick. No freaking way. We're actually gonna mill him. We're gonna fatigue him. We're gonna do what this deck does best. The boy on fire. I think we can go for one more. Oh, are you sneezy, my little silver dragon? Come here. You okay, Dispy? Oh, she's sneezing. She's sick. Oh, my baby cat. This is our last game. Oh! I really need a fiery war axe and maybe a slam. Nope. So, uh, once again, I'd like to emphasize that tomorrow is one of the most excited I have ever been to do a day off, ever. Because it's Stardew Valley 1.1, which is both a new game, but a game I've played before and know I love. <gasps> Greetings, friend. <laughs> Greetings. This is, this is an okay mixture. It actually dawns on me that I don't necessarily need to win with like a 70 damage combo at the end. I too could try to pull off a win by just having 70 armor really early. Stardew Valley is so good. Stardew Valley 1.1 completely new farmland setups. <laughs> Synovial Thread 6 says 1.1 is finally going up. Dude, it's up. It was up on Monday. Could be our mid ranger friend. This is, a, this is a very bad collection of cards. Oh sh shit! Oh god! Oh well, he didn't evolve th that turn. This is still terrible, terrible news. I think we just gotta do this, though. And <laughs> he, like, plays a Cold Eyed Oracle, and I'm like, ah! Who am I gonna romance? I don't know. I don't know. I got tired of Penny. I'm gonna go for Leah this time. Don't. Yeah, that's really bad for us. But this is a little better. None may steal our secrets. If he draws an evolve proper, we might be fucked. I think I'm probably not gonna run down the just car on six. This can be this can be really powerful, this revenge. I'm just gonna probably just skill Vanus Sylvanus.
just want to be a little bit more thoughtful. DJ Tyrant is hosting. Oh my god, what up, DJ Tyrant? It was good to see you this weekend, man. I literally just hugged him twice and just ran away. The game begins. Oh! Okay, so we've seen both his Master of Evolutions. My totems! My pretty totems! Jesus. My He's used most of his Evolveronis. Uh, I've used both of my Revenges, though. Oof, it's gonna be hard. Slam! Slam! Ah! I think we lost. I gotta. Anything but the 6-5. The 0-2 would be great. I'm literally getting everything off this board. And then we're going to start armoring up. Did you bring some fish? Oh my god. Remember me. I should run out the Violet Illusionist. Five health is a bad amount of health. Maybe that's maybe that's how we lose this game. Did you bring some fish? It's a little more okay for us. I mean, once we can once we can start really gaining the armor. Not good. Oh, fuck. How does he kill me? Just with a rock biter and then another and then another one? 
A lightning bolt. Look behind you. Oh! Phenicia says, why kill the 2-3 as opposed to the 3-2? Some bullshit about how I wanted my 2-6 to be able to kill his 2-6. I'd like to give a shout out to the Cold Light Oracle that brought to us a glorious brawl. Well, the health is at 11 from heaven. <laughs> Part of me is tickled by the fact that our opponent's name is. Pfft. That's a wrath of air. And I am my very own activator for Execute. Oh. <laughs> I'll never tell. Hello, welcome to the team. One, two, it's me and you. Both. What you win this yes. <laughs> yes. And as we all know, the plural of bonus is boni. What a stream! Look at the 169 wins of the warrior. I hate that class, man. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go because it's 9:10. We did a long show today. It was a good one. And uh, oh my God, Stardew Valley is gonna happen tomorrow. Oh. Oh. Stardew Valley is going to be happening tomorrow all day from 11 to 7, just like our health was in that last game. 7 health to 11 health. Mm. So that's how you know it's going to be a good stream. Uh, to all the wonderful Twitch Prime folks, there's literally so many of you, I'm unsure how to say thank you. Literally, physically, I'm unsure how to do it. Whether I should just read the several hundred names that sub today? I don't know. This is something that I think I and all the other Twitch streamers are going to try to figure out over the next week. <laughs> like, we're just going to try to understand, to wrap our heads around what it means to have this gigantic an influx. As, you know, uh, the Twitch guy said on Twitter, his LinkedIn chat, that um, some streamers are experiencing 2, 3, or even 4x the total number of subs on their channel. So this is, for many people, a 2, 3, 4x number of folks chatting as well. So um, that's amazing. Thumbs up to all of you. I'll see ya. I'll see ya tomorrow. Show is over, baby.